Hi, I'm Torstein from Cinema Terror, and today I'll we'll be talking about the gory, black comedy, horror musical film Poultrygeist Night of the Chicken Dead. By Troma, of course. Poultrygeist was not an easy production for Troma and their co owner slash director Lloyd Kaufman. It followed up the terrible and troubled Tales from the Crapper from 2004, and the production didn't go all that smoothly on this one either. It had trouble getting its financing together, even having Lloyd putting up money from his own retirement savings in order to get it complete, and it also had to rely on amateurs, consisting of either young aspiring actors and filmmakers, and or trauma fans from all over the world, doing work for a grueling amount of hours each day during filming, for little or no pay at all. The final film did overcome these obstacles, much in thanks to Kaufman's 30 plus years of experience doing movies within this budget range, and a tireless effort by everyone else involved. I am happy to say that I think Poltergeist ended up becoming Trauma's best movie since Terror Firmer, and it is now considered to be a classic trauma film in the same regards as mentioned Terror Firmer, Toxic Avenger, Troma and Juliet, and the likes of those. The comedy of Troma is absolutely acquired taste, but it feels a bit stronger on this production than the average ones, and even a bit more accessible, I might dare to say. The musical acts are all great, the gory silly and schlocky, and the criticism of American fast food industry is on point and works excellently. That social commentary can be translated beyond just the fast food industry, and it wouldn't be a stretch if we could take it as Troma's view on the film industry as well, with the big evil corporations doing whatever they can to deliver a product that are just out there to make a profit, while the little guy who are in it for the love of it all will be left behind suffering. Even some of the acting is better than decent, especially with the main guy, Jason Jakanen, who brought so much enthusiasm to the film that it easily translates through the screen. There is also a making of documentary called Poultry in Motion being made during the filming of Poultrygeist, and it is a fascinating look into how low budget movie productions can be. Aspiring filmmakers should definitely want to check this one out as it holds nothing back and is not afraid of painting an honest and raw picture of the production and everyone involved, including our own beloved Uncle Lloyd. Poltergeist Night of the Chicken Dead is a silly, fantastic, over-the-top comedy horror that sets itself apart from everything else out there, even other trauma movies. The trauma tropes might be all there, but it feels like a film that takes place in the neighborhood of Traumaville and not in the middle of it. Poltergeist is a must-buy for trauma fans, but even if you aren't necessarily into all of their other films, I still say you should give this film a chance if you're into stupid and gory B-movies.